Hi, I'm Patrick McMurray, world champion oyster shucker and inventor of this, the Shucker Patty Universal Oyster Knife. We call it universal because it works on all types of oysters. Whether it's big or small, this one can shuck it all. The main differences between this knife and other oyster knives is because it's got an ergodynamic handle. There's two axes here, one this way and one this way, creating a lever. You actually lever open up the oysters and that makes you open them up with less force. Less force means it's easier and it's safer to open oysters this way. Another point of interest on the oyster knife is this integrated finger guard that protects your hands from oyster shell hits. The other special detail about this knife is the notch blade. This is what I've designed to get around most oyster shells that are very deep cups to get towards the adductor muscle to sever off the adductor muscle at the bottom. The notch blade gets you up and over the outer lip of the shell onto the adductor muscle to clean off the bottom very quickly. And with the Shucker Patty Oyster Knife, you can actually work on all different types of oysters. Big, small, standards, choice, doesn't matter. It can shuck all of them because that's what we have to do at the Oyster Bar. So we're going to show you with five different types of shells here that I have. Here's a lovely choice oyster. We go in with a lovely large hinge, in the hinge, quick turn, cut the top off, save the shell, look for grit, and cut with that notch blade underneath and it works beautifully. Put your shell top like this, the standard grade oyster. It's got a very odd shape to it. You'll get more standards than anywhere else. You can actually shuck with this one as well. So you have to line it up, insert the blade into the hinge, very slow, quarter turn, pops it open. Now, you may have something here where the top shell leaves a little bit left on the adductor muscle. We call this a hockey puck. It's what we do up here in Canada. So what you want to do is you want to push down on the side closest to yourself Put the blade underneath and very slowly cut towards yourself, just severing off that little piece of shell, and there, your oyster is saved. You put underneath, you cut the adductor muscle, and away you go. Now you can plant that one there. Save your top shell for presentation. Always looks nice in that situation. Now we've got a Kumamoto, originally from Japan, grown in Washington State. Very small, flat top, very deep cup to it, so it rocks around a lot. So you want to hold on to it so it doesn't wiggle around. Insert the blade into the hinge. Quick turn, pops it open, cuts the adductor muscle, look for the hinge where it breaks, and then you have cut the bottom and away you go. Then we have a lovely Pacific Oyster. These ones are, tend to be a little bit bigger. This one's on the small side. Flat top, very deep cup. Again, it's going to rock around. You want to insert the blade into the hinge again, and then a quarter turn as it's set. You cut the top off, you come around cut underneath that notch blade coming underneath that outer edge and it's absolutely brilliant, ready to go. One of the harder oysters to open is a European flat, Ostera edulis, because of its flatness and deep cup, it's got a very small hinge, very difficult to open, but this is what we have to open in the World Championships. Again, the knife tip is such that it will enter quite nicely, allowing a good spot to torque it open right there. You pry it open, cut at the adductor muscle, she's all ready to go, cut underneath, look for that grit, place it there, and away you go. This is the clam. Now a clam's a little different, it's got two adductor muscles, one here, one here. I'm gonna go in through the hinge right at this point here, give it a little turn, opens it up, then you keep your knife tip pointed, cutting here at the, this adductor muscle, and then turn the shell to that adductor muscle. You've got it open now, cut underneath and cut underneath, and this is the beauty part of the notch blade. One, two, already done and you place it there and away you go. I'm Shucker Patty and that's Oyster 101 with the Shucker Patty Oyster Knife.